So I have decided to make another video, you know, not two videos in a day, since I got some free time in my hand right now. That's your boy Lakitu, man, back at it with another one, you heard? Shit, y'all niggas see the glow, man. You see my skin, my shit beautiful, dog. My shit. My shit beautiful, man. I just need a fucking lineup or a haircut right now. Hair looking bad, bad. But yeah, man, the topic of this video is how not to relapse on semen retention. How I made it so far on 1,213 days of semen retention. The key is self-discipline and praying to the most high, man. Real talk. Shit. I'm going to give you one tip right now off the rip. You heard me? One tip I have is to take out social media. Delete social media, man. That shit is a major distraction. They're trying to promote as much porn as possible right now on social media. Like a kid's porn. You know, they, you know they can't show too much. So, yeah. They're trying to promote as, as many new girls, news. You know what's crazy right now? You know what's crazy? They're promoting so much porn right now to distract you. Heck, a beat y'all meet every day. Shit, can become beta bitches. You heard me? Beta bitches. They're promoting so much porn right now that everybody and their mamas on Instagram that's a female have only fans account and y'all sent bass niggas is subscribing to that shit and paying 30 bucks no 50 15 or 30 bucks y'all lame ass boys paying all that money just to see some fucking toes and titties all covered up and shit you heard me that's some lame ass shit man yes y'all could bust three nuts a day you know what i'm saying to clean yourself and shit man real talk and that's, that's why you're always relapsing Because Instagram has you all distracted The Matrix had you so prone them to your phone already That You can't go like 3 hours or 2 hours without using your phone You know what I'm saying And I know right off the rip And if you are using your phone You're going straight to Instagram And watch some bad bitches post some shits and thongs and shit I mean that's all the distraction though That's for you to be at your lower self You know what I'm saying That's why you don't see the blessings from God you keep busting so many nuts. You don't see no blessings from God. You think it's, you think it's not a sin just beating your meat every day, nigga. That shit is a sin. You know what I'm saying, man? That's why most of y'all don't have the glow. You know what I'm saying? That's why my skin is way better than some of these females out here, cause I'm not putting a fake mask, nigga. Real mask on, nigga. Real mask on. You know what I'm saying? I'm looking at it straight in the eyes. I know y'all feel my energy. Real, real talk. I'm going to tell you a second tip on not how to relapse, man. Make sure you pray to the Lord, man. Ask the Lord. Lord, please don't give me a lot of temptation while I'm on the semen retention. Bars, you hear me? Just like that. You know, make sure you have faith in him too. Because faith is the key in life to be progressing, man. Have faith in him, man. Real talk. Ask him just like that. Don't let me be on this temptation. And just, you know, let me progress in life on semen retention. And then he's going to deliver the energy. He's going to kind of switch your mindset when you go to sleep. To not think of lust so much. You're still going to have thought because temptation still has to come to you. Regardless, you got to pass these trials and tribulations. But when you ask him to take you on a certain streak, or let's say you want to be on 100 days. Without me asking for him back in the grip. Like six months ago or nine months ago, back in the grip, without me asking him, it was man, all of a sudden I was relapsing every time. And then when I started having a relationship with the Most High God, you know what I'm saying? I started building a strong relationship with him. Started asking him to help me discipline myself more. He just gave me that that intuition inside of me. You heard me? Just like to analyze things before it happens. You know what I'm saying? Like let's see if I do bust. I I, I think this shit before. You know. If I do bust, I'm going to lose my angel powers. I'm going to be depleted. My skin is not going to glow as much. It's going to glow. But it's not going to glow as much. I'm not going to have these perfect perfect white teeth. You hear me? Like, I'm not going to have that shit like that. Because my zinc is going to be depleted. It's going to be down in the in the gutter. You hear me? It's going to be down in the gutter. So, yeah, man. Ask God to, to give you as much discipline. Cause he's always with you man And inside of you You just still haven't acknowledged him Cause all those sins you're committing You know what I'm saying And yeah man I'm gonna give you a third reason 
on how not to relapse. Make sure you eat as healthy as you can, man. If you eat as healthy as you can and you see the benefits on semen retention, why would you want to relapse? Remember, junk food equals junk food equals it equals a bad body and a bad spirit. So when you start eating junk food, you get the mindset of shit man, I also wanna fuck some bitches right now. You hear me? I wanna release right now. So when you start eating for example, when you start eating healthy, you're trying to better yourself. You're trying to be stronger. You're not trying to relapse. You're trying to have a better physique and a better outlook on life. You know what I'm saying? Because you're eating healthy. You're not eating that negative energy energy food. You're eating positive food. Remember, fruits that have seeds in it. Not no GMO pool shit. You heard me. Fruits that have seeds in it. That's going to benefit you. You know. Clear skin and all of that boo. You heard me? So remember, eat healthy and stay motivated. In order for you not to relapse on Seymour attention, man. Real talk. I'm going to give you a four tip, man. You know what I'm saying? Don't listen to your boys. Because I know I have some friends that I know from down in the pen. I know them and shit. They be like, yo, bro, why you not watching Hub no more? You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit is totally natural and normal. Because, you know, they've been, they've been so, so brain fogged by the media. And the Matrix, you know, they're bots. So they think it's okay to just bust because it relaxes your body for two seconds and then you feel just like shit. You know what I'm saying? They think it's okay to bust every time. Don't, don't, man. Don't believe them, man. I'm going to be honest with you. It's a bad spirit going into the body trying to trick you out of your position, my nigga. It's a bad spirit. Don't get tricked, man. I'm looking straight in the eyes right now. I'm dead ass. Don't get tricked out of your position, man. It's a demon. <laughs> In their body, some consciously acting kind of nice, trying to trick you, trying to think porn is normal and busting nuts is normal, so you can go back to your lower self, your low vibration self, man. It's a temptation, basically. It's a task you gotta pass. That God is trying to give you, man. You know what I'm saying? Cause God is always with you, but He just gotta give you tasks so you can grow stronger. That's why I'm on such on a high streak right now, 20 or 12 days. And when you at home, man, I'm about to finish this video soon. When you at home and you feel like the urge, let's you're on quarantine, man, I'm gonna give you the best tip right now. You're on quarantine and you just get a massive rock hard on it, man. Just start busting out like 70 pushes right there, man. I know you might have the stick locked and loaded, you know what I'm saying? You might have the Rose and Petersburg locked and loaded. But still, man, just do the push ups. Use that energy, that sexual energy that you have down there. Raise it up on your body and do some push-ups, get it up on your muscle, man. So when you go outside, you attract some bad bitches. Or maybe the love of your life, my nigga. Real street shit. Don't go to the bathroom, just bust it off, you hear me? Shit is some lame man shit, dog. I have some 30 old man or 40 old man tell me, yo, you mad young, why you not watching no hub and point busting all the time? I was like, I'm not no lame ass nigga. Do I look like a pathetic human to you? And they was just shut. They was puzzled, my nigga. They was in shock. Had an answer I gave them. You know what I'm saying? Because at my age, I'm 22. At my age, a nigga like me telling them that shit. Nigga won't think that shit. You know what I'm saying? Niggas won't say that shit at my age. You hear me? Because they don't want to be. They don't want to be in that category that they, they think they're weird. They're going to be called so weird for not watching Hub. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. To each his own, though. I'm just different. I come from a different light, and I've been here for a long time in this world. I'm an old spirit, my nigga. So I'm do I'm on such on this long journey. You know what I'm saying? I'm just here to finish my mission and going back to heaven. <laughs> you know. But yeah, man. The last tip I'm gonna give you is always think before you battle bust and watch porn. Always think of the risk you're going through right now. Remember, you're gonna feel depleted. One. Female attraction is going to go away. No clear skin. You might get sick because your body already got used to not busting the nuts and retaining and saving all that sexual energy to benefit your body. That's four right there. You heard me. Um, the fifth one is that um, you're not going to have perfect test. Like your testosterone is going to decrease, but not too much. But it's not going to be as efficient. Like you can sleep. You can't sleep three hours no more and just go to work. You're going to need that nine hours of sleep, man. And still, you're still going to be tired at work. 
for me, I'm a real gangster. Three hours, I don't get tired, nigga. St back to the money, straight hustling. Providing for the family, you heard me? Shit got me, put me in this position, cause he knew, he believed in me. He knew I had to feed the family, man. Like, real talk. Hey, man, yeah. Make sure it's your boy, the key too. Like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure I helped you out. If I helped you out, comment below. Let me know if I helped you out, cause I really try hard on these videos. Right now, I'm about to edit this shit. It's about to take me like an hour or so. And yeah, man, this your boy, the key too. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'm out, you hear me? Almost at 455 subs, by the way.